and the crowd are enjoying it. Cameron White. Strike rate of 135, an average of 33 from 13 matches. He's a big, powerful hitter of the ball, Cameron White. And boy, he needs to be. Like he was on again, but we're, we're in a pretty good position here. That Oh, no. Oh, well, that certainly helps. A great shot by Cameron White. Six over extra cover. Yeah, this is a really big over of the game, I think. This is Dan's last over, and he's obviously the go-to guy to, for New Zealand. If, if we can go wicketless through this over, and with a couple of those, it'd be very handy on the scoreboard. Well, I was going to say, Dave Hussey was a big loss, but then by that shot from Cameron White. Cameron White. Got to be one of the keys for Australia. He's got to try and remain there. Oh, what a shot. What a shot that is. Boy, that is superb timing. Vittori tried to go in at the leg stump. And Cameron White was up to it. Not often you see a shot like this off Vittori. Look at this. That is just a pure cricket shot. Beautiful shot. And extra cover. All timing. There's a powerful man. Oh, straight back down the ground. One bounce, four. Bad delivery, got punished. Yeah, he's powerful, all right, because he didn't hit this very well at all, and yet he was still confident enough to stand there and know that it was going for four. Got very low on the bat. Well, New Zealand uh, under real pressure all of a sudden. Australia, the class act that they are, they've come back. One big over either way. Oh, I think that's big enough for six. That's huge from Cameron White. Stand and deliver and pummel. He just muscled this over. He is lining up that straight boundary. You know that's where he's headed. And anything you can get underneath, he is giving it the right heave-ho. Oh, just never timed it really, but that was a free hit. Big over for the Aussies. 166 for three. Oh, that is massive. Short arm jab. I'm not sure why he went over the wicket and looked to go pitch it on that close, to be honest. Because that's right in the arc. That's right in the slot. That's nonchalant. Stand and deliver. Straight down the ground, that'll be a four. He pierces the gap. So a big one there, Borum just getting the length wrong. I'll tell you what, White knows when he's hit it for four. He just stood there after this. Meanwhile, Clark was hearing down. He was running between the wickets. Look at him go. He wasn't taking the risk that that would be cut off. 266 runs today in boundaries. Again, straight down the ground. Straight again for four. Back-to-back -back full tosses, back-to-back -back boundaries. Pure power. Pure power. He hasn't hit this that well at all. He has not timed this. He is muscling that down the ground. He's just making that boundary look way too small. Now it's Oram who's under immense pressure. Tim South, he's going to have to bowl the last over here. And one of these last two balls, New Zealand, big trouble. And that is big. How big? At six! He's pounded it down the ground and Oram's copping a hiding here. And for Cameron White, he's gone through to 55 off just 21 balls. Spectacular. Take a bow, Cameron White. Take a big bow. Strike rate, 262. Someone had to do it if they were going to get close. He has done everything that's been required of him so far. He has muscled them straight. And the ground again. Trace a bullet for four. Oh, so strong, so powerful. How does he do it? He, anything he can get hit straight, he hits it so straight. That wasn't a bad delivery. He nearly took Saudi out in the process. He nearly killed him. He nearly killed him. Oh, goodness me.